Hey, Bart Miller with Cycling Strong. So I'm super excited to do this amazing project. Now, most of you don't know uh, this project at all. That's why I wanted to talk about it here on the channel and do a quick introduction. So I have Fahim Rahim with me. This is Dr. Rahim. It comes right down to it. He's an amazing kidney doctor, amazing specialist. But more than that, he's an amazing giver, philanthropist, wow. and just an amazing Thank individual. You. So I want you to get to know him. Now, we're going to do an amazing ride coming up called the Leadville Trail 100 Mountain Bike Race. It's classified as one of the hardest races in North America. It's an amazing wow. race. Most of you know I've done it a couple times. Now, with a lot of uh, prodding and lots of fun like that, I've put a fun team together this year that's going to go and we're going to do this race together. But more than that, Fahim and I were talking a little bit here a couple days ago or a week ago, and he said, Bart, you know, for me to make it through this type tough of a race, I really need some inspiration and you know he's gathered so much inspiration purpose. in his yeah purpose that's what it was he said i need a purpose and he goes i've got that purpose in mind and i really want to do it would you be part of that and i said of course anything to give back so i'm going to let him talk about that and i hope that you will get behind us in this project and you'll be thinking about these people on that day now most of you know you can track us on the tour tracker for that day so there's actually a link that we can give you you can track us exactly where we're at in the race okay. find out our results our time and where we're at and you can actually make comments along the way and we we can get those at the end of the race we'll read them we're not going to read them during the race but other people that are there like my son kobe my wife sunny they'll actually see those on the update and you can give us encouragement along the way so i encourage you to do that now cycling strong is really getting behind this project because we have a lot of belief in it in Nepal, there's been some amazing things that have happened. You know that. But we haven't, I don't think, got behind Nepal as much as we should have or we still could. So Fahim yeah. is going to talk about that a little bit. I'm going to let him, I'm going to sit back, let him talk about this and kind of give us the background, who we're going to support during this race. We've actually made some stickers for our bikes. We've got the Nepal flag mm -hmm. on them, the U.S. flag mm -hmm. on them. And tell us about this tell us so, what we're gonna do well thanks Bart you thanks bet. for having me on your on your blog and your show so I, I'm Dr. Rahim I actually led one of the largest uh, international medical disaster team privately funded right after the earthquake we got to do a lot of good work in Nepal there's still a lot more that needs to be done but the biggest thing in any tragedy that happens is we forget you know we human beings right yep. we forget a couple of weeks a couple of months later uh, but my mission here is not to let people forget not to forget about Nepal not forget about the girls that I'm going to talk about, especially Sydney, whom I'm, you know, dedicating my right to. Um, and I mean, this truly is going to be one of the toughest days in my life. I mean, you've done it. I mean, even tell me, is yeah. this an easy race to do? I mean, it's, I no. mean, I did, I did a stage race in three days and, and I think I almost died. Thanks to you, I survived. <laughs> <laughs> but doing it in one day, this is going to be crazy. I mean, people, I mean, elite riders have done, said this is the toughest day of their life. Right. So. But I want to challenge myself because I want people to remember, not my race, not my ride, whether I'm going to finish 100 miles or whether I'm going to finish in nine hours or what be the case, but, but the cause. Because everything in life has to have a purpose. If I'm going to train this hard and sacrifice my life, my time, my family time, everything has got to have a purpose. And the purpose for this ride for me, which I would inspire all of you, is to remember each one of the people who are uh, um, affected, their lives are affected by Nepal quick, especially uh, my good friend Diane. Um, we lost Sydney. Sydney was 19 years old, um, and this ride is for her. And then all the 9,000 people have lost their lives. We have six U.S. Marines, two Nepali Army soldiers who who died, and and people are still dying. I mean, we I met some people today. There was a landslide last week in 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 a city called Pokhara, uh, where over 30 people um, died. So I want people to remember Nepal problem it still exists. Um, Americans, the world, everyone is behind uh, this cause, and and hopefully we will, you know, I will finish this ride because I know you will. <laughs> if I survive this ride and yeah. I'm alive, and and that will be that will be good because I I want that's my inspiration because my inspiration as much as suffering I'm going to go through all I'm going to be thinking of um, the hashtag that Diane gave me which is what would Sydney do, um, you know, keep pushing forward. Yep. So hashtag, what would Cindy do? The other part is, is that once again, this comes down to, and I'm going to take it off right now. It's not just okay. about this right here. He's which just is, taking off his belt. Well, I'm trying to take it off, but it, 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 it might not even happen here because it's so, uh, so tight around my waist. But uh, yeah, it it's is. not, it's not about just this buckle right here, right? That's not what we're doing this 100% right. for. Now the buckle's really cool and it's super fun to 
to you know to show off and all that kind of fun stuff and the stage race belts that we've got but ultimately we're doing this for some individuals that lost precious life for um, something they had no control of but uh, anyway stay tuned to this this is an exciting thing it's really gonna be fun beautiful girl I mean look at that right imagine that was your daughter would that would that mean something to you and I know it would that's why we're doing this okay so we're gonna ride for, for purpose Sydney. yeah we're gonna have yeah, a lot of fun a lot of energy at the Leadville Trail 100 mountain bike race but more than that we're gonna go out there and accomplish something big I hope you do the same thing get out there ride your bike get below go to the hashtag do whatever but get behind Nepal support them get behind Fahim's foundation go to JRM foundation look at the causes that they're doing they're raising money for get behind that and uh, we'll have some more videos out there and we'll let you know how and we do follow us and see, you know see what happens but again in life everything has to have a purpose and a meaning and yeah. and with everything you do in your life you got to try to make a difference around you and just inspire others and keep moving forward so that's our message from cycling strong yeah JR Foundation cycling strong comment below we'll get to you have a great day we'll see you, you later